guys welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be closing out the last week of october and opening up the first week of november which is always very fun to start a new month so without further ado let's just begin uh we are starting with the expenses for this week we have 46 28 in groceries 16 48 in spending 48.62 in dine out 555 was travel this was the deduction of the amount i needed for my trip to uh the us so i calculated everything that i spent so 88.52 was in subscriptions i bought a gym subscription and i paid for my phone for two months then utilities um 13.27 16.05 was for medicine uh, 909 was beauty. I bought a new hair oil and 39.48 was for a birthday gift for a friend. So in total, I spent 832 euros and 79 cents for the last week of October. So let me quickly flip through the budget and write the actual amount. So we had 585 euros to work with for uh, this week. So groceries, oops. My cord for my microphone is moving. Oops. So let me check out if we have any rollover. Groceries has a rollover of one, two, three, and four. So we spent 46 here. Spending has a rollover of one, two, and three. So we spent 17 here. And dine out has a rollover of one. So we spent 49 here. Let me fix my microphone. Sorry. There, that might be better. And then all of this rollover amount, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight euros, we're gonna add into the miscellaneous uh, envelope. So let me add this here. And it should be now 348 so 200 320 40 41 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 perfect that's that so that's for the rollover amounts and uh, rent got 75 utilities got 50 and miscellaneous got five plus the eight that we added just now so the actual amount was 13 so 46 plus 17 plus 49 plus 75 plus 50 plus 13 is 250. 585 minus 250 is 335. Then we're, we brought that here to short-term sinking funds. And here we put 40 in beauty, 20 in clothing, 10 in gifts, 50 in health, 10 in subscriptions, and 50 in travel. So that was 180 in total. Uh, 335 minus 180 was 155. 155 we brought down to long-term sinking funds. Babies got a five, as did car. Deposit got 25, and then we put five into pets, retirement, technology, and weddings each. So in total, that was 55 euros. And 155 minus 55 is 100, and all of that 100 we put into our savings challenges so that was the budget for the last week of october so i'm gonna put this off to the side but i will return to that uh booklet in uh i think next week sweetie not the next week's video next video or the video after that because we have to finalize all of our sinking funds and close out the budget of october but i am now flipping to november and flipping to the first week here to go through the paycheck uh, for the 2nd of November, paycheck number 1st, and we are working with 600 euros for this week. So as usual, we're gonna put 50 in groceries, 20 in, 20 in spending, and 50 in dine out. I'm gonna put five into gas, rent is going to get 75, 50 is going into mis uh, utilities, sorry, and miscellaneous is getting a five. So in total, that is 255 euros. So 600 minus 255 is 345. We're bringing that here to short-term sinking funds. We're gonna put 40 in beauty, 20 in clothing, 10 into gifts. We're putting 50 into health, 
and 15 in subscriptions and 50 in travel. So in total for sure term sinking funds, we are putting 185 euros in there. So 345 minus 185 is 160. And then we're bringing that down here to long term sinking funds. We are adding five into babies, five into car, 25 in deposit. We're gonna put five into pets, five in technology, and five in weddings. So in total, that's going to be, it should be five plus five, 25 plus five, plus five plus five, 50 euros, perfect. So 160 minus 50 is 110. And all of that 110 is gonna go into our savings challenges, which is so fun to see. It's always more fun to do the same challenges if you have more money to stop there. So that is all for the first paycheck of November. Once again, I will do a video where I close out the budget of October soon, but in tomorrow's video, I'm going to do a cash stuffing of this paycheck. So stay tuned for that. Also, if you haven't seen two of my la latest travel vlogs, I did go to the US and Warsaw and Poland. So go check those out. Once again, check out the description box for any discount codes and any good thingies that I can share with you and you can benefit off of. Uh, but yeah, I think that's all for the news. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. We have fun over here. I'll be back very soon with more videos. But in the meanwhile, I wish you a very wonderful day and I hope to see you next time. Bye!